Hi everyone. What I have to share with you today is maintenance that I'm doing to my weather station air dehydration. I want you to follow me as I do these steps. So the first is removing the conduits that contain the beads from the junction box outside. I've brought it into my home because it's cooling off. The beads inside these conduits kind of gelled into one big blob with the little spaces in between. So I had to use something long to loosen them to get them out of the conduit. You could have just as easily used threaded rod, for example, or depending on the length of your conduit, you know, a chopstick or something else that was straight, narrow and long like wood dowel. It's extremely important to be careful in your aiming so that these beads end up in the container and not in the mouth of your pet or child. These beads expand as they come into contact with moisture. So this is a passive humidity system for air dehydrating. You know, these are the holes that air sucks through the conduit when it's attached to the junction box. There's two 12 volt DC fans pulling the air through. And so they passively collect the air by the surface area of the beads. So what I have are 30,000 beads per side. They're roughly 1 16th of an inch or approximately one millimeter wide each. And you can see here that I'm paying immaculate attention to detail that I don't let these beads just fall around. And I wanted you to see me doing this for this exact reason so that you're safe, your pets, and especially your children. So I put the little plastic bag at the edge and just gently poured it into this. If you're worried about spilling them on the floor, what you would use is a funnel, like going to your kitchen and getting a funnel and pouring them in through this. But it's not just pouring them into the conduit that matters. You need to also get the beads out that are stuck by friction. And that's where you see me sticking the bag that contained them into the conduit and tapping it after I've dumped out the ones that came freely. And it was really important to do this just for the safety, especially of friends bringing young children over to my home. I bought these beads on AliExpress searching for water absorbing beads. There's no lack of places to buy them from online. And there's 101 colors to choose from. I just happen to like the color blue. It's more concentrated in its shrunk form. So to help you understand, these work the same as a diaper does absorbing urine. The polymer that's in a diaper is able to absorb several times its weight as, as a child involuntarily urinates while wearing their diaper. This is sort of the same type of system here. The water in the air passes through these beads and then I put so many beads in so that the air gets out of it. And the idea is that the electronics in the outdoor junction box do not experience a power arc because the air is moving and because the air that's entering the junction box has passed through these conduits and has had a chance to be dehydrated. The alternative is running an air conditioning system. This is not really practical for, you know, weather station setup. It's just such a small item that a passive air collection like this is much more important than pursuing an actual air conditioning setup. 
This is what I had to share for you today. I wish you well in your project. Bye for now.